Okay, welcome back. So we're going to finish up section two here with some um, editing and creation in the products and services, right? So, so uh, Tad Gaming has certain uh, services and uh, that they need to put in to be able to sell and uh, and and have certain items in there to sell. So they're not necessarily a they don't have physical products, but they're going to. Um, have services. So I'm going to go ahead and go to the, the gear icon on the top right and go to products and services. That's going to bring up this uh, screen. So we're going to go ahead and uh, click add item, right? So up until this point we haven't started working with inventory at all. So we're going to go ahead and do add item here and that'll bring up um, uh, the option to do um, to add products and services, right? So we're going to add some services and make sure we're all lined out. So uh, to begin with though, before we do, let's go ahead and X out over here to the top right and it'll show us what we currently have as services. So really all we have are sales, right, and hours. And so we need to add a couple to that. Uh, we have uh, sales and hours uh, that we need. We need to use those that are currently in there, but we need to add some additional. So I'm going to show you how to add some. Well, I'm also going to show you how to edit these uh, existing ones. Hello, so we're going to walk through real quick how to set up new uh, a new service for our company. So we're going to go up here up to the top right, the green button here, we're going to click new. There's also an arrow there that will give you uh, the option to import, right? But we're going to go ahead and just click the new button and it will bring up this uh, side panel here up on the right. Uh, we're going to be adding a service. So all these in the TAD uh, gaming um, st case study, uh, they're all going to be uh, services. So there are different types, right? So there's non-inventory uh, items, there's also um, you can turn on the inventory tracking and um, we're, I'll talk about that in another video. We'll do that at another time and do some inventory uh, videos as well. But right now we're going to do service. So I'll click on service here. It brings it up, gives me an option to put that in. So I'm going to do um, composer and sounds. Okay, so that's the name of the first one there. Um, we're going to go into the type is service, of course, and um, our uh, sales description is going to be the same, so we can go ahead and copy that and paste that down there. Um, and then our, uh, we don't have a price for that. We do have an income account though. The income account is going to be uh, revenue. So uh, right there, the 40,000. So it'll be revenue right there. So we're gonna select that. And that really, when we make the sale, right, uh, that's gonna be the revenue account that is uh, credited, right? Because re uh, revenues are credit. So it's gonna credit the revenue and it's gonna debit just to review the accounting, right? Credit the revenue, it, it, the debit is gonna be either cash, right? If we get paid right away as we do this, or it will be an accounts receivable if they're gonna pay us later. So that those, those are the possible debits really on the other side. So we're gonna go ahead and do save and close and we see right there, it comes in um, for us here. Uh, we can, if we want to change the uh, different columns on this view. We can go here and we can change the different columns so we can get rid of some of those. And um, uh, yeah, so we can change the columns if we want to. So that's totally possible. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and add the rest of these real quick. So I'm going to do the same thing. And then once I get the, the new ones added in there, I'm going to show you how to edit the, the hours and the sales that are currently already there. So there's just a few edits we need to do. So I'm going to go ahead and add these here. Okay, so now I've got all of those added in there, right? So we've got all those added in there. And now what we're gonna do is we are going to edit, uh, make sure we have uh, our hours correct. 
uh, on there. So I'm going to go over here to edit on the right side of hours and we see that we do have to change the income account here just to match up with what we have here in our in our case study. We're going to do the same thing for sales. That's also going to be revenue. All right, and there, there it is. So that uh, looks like we have the product all set up. So this is really a, a section where we're going to be setting stuff up. Here in um, our next section, we're going to show a little bit of um, some of the reporting and, and things we're going to be doing uh, to kind of set some other things up as well for our company. And so we'll see you in the next video.